before I get into it. Oh. Testing the lag here. Testing the lag here. Oh, that's not bad at all. Testing the lag here. Oh, that's not bad at all. Testing the lag here. Oh, that's not bad at all. Uh -oh. <laughs> I'm in a loop. Feedback. And people are jumping in to the chat. I just need to share this around. Okay. Okay, here we go. Jesus, stay back. <laughs> Whoo, shake and bake. All right, 
Just want to avoid him. Bro, you can climb ladders. Alright, so let's see, I'm going to move this inside, I don't need to worry about this right now, I'm going to move that inside, um, we'll move the blue herb inside as well, I just got to lose this guy. Is there any gunpowder besides that one? Oh yeah, there we go, there we go, take that out. It's really nice of him to like wait while I'm doing all this item management. <laughs> um, I don't have any healing, so I'm gonna have to get that because he's probably gonna hit me one good time. Put that there. Mm, I think that's it, actually. We'll store that. Hey, great indoors. Alright. Ah, I think that's it. Alright, time to go. Did you manage to fix the heat issues? No, I'm afraid not. I'm doing this while cold. I am sipping a lot of coffee, though. Hear what? The furnace! No. I think it came on. You think the furnace came on? Yeah. 
Um, we'll see. yet. Looks like I lost him for now. have a heart key right I do this nigga is not down here is he shit I think he is Motherfucker be power walking. Shit, 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 shit. You motherfucker! Uh, I'm gonna have to heal myself. Um, let me think here. What do I do? fucked up. I should have jumped the wall in there where the um where Mr. X was at. <sighs> I gotta run for the reception and then come back in. I don't think I'll be able to do anything else with this this liquor back here. Mm. 
All right. We're just going to be from here, eh? Yep. All right. Uh, let's go. gun? Yeah, okay. Did it come on? No, it just sounds like it was trying to. Just something I haven't heard in a while, I guess. So we're going to try this this way. I'll go into the west storage room. What's that? Dial lock. And then maybe I can like get downstairs and get into the storage room from there. I'm not sure how he's tracking me or if he's just like walking around. Wasn't there before? If he comes in there while I'm like trying to sneak past that guy, I'm fucked. So we gotta do this another way. We have to go back into the main room. I could go this way to the linen room, which I think diamond door. I do have the key to that, don't I? I do. Let's try that. There was a liquor in here, but I killed him already, so they might just spawn another one, but one would hope that's not the case. The key, key card to get out of the garage, yeah. But, I mean, I'm, I'm not done obviously exploring, like, the mansion. So, all right, linen room, uh, gunpowder will combine with this, excellent. All right, and there's nothing else, no, there's something. Portable safe, we're about to take a look at this.
Oh, come on. Okay. Ah. Oh. <laughs> All right. Mm-hmm. The other key. Good. It's not a good place to be. Okay, so now I'm going to try to get to the star's office. Yes. Hopefully dude doesn't end up in here. Letter to Stars members. Uh, to my best of stars, buds. How are y'all doing in that drab old station? Hanging in there against old irons? Me? I just got back from a date with a hot chick. Bet you can guess what we got up to under the extra her extra large umbrella. Europe is amazing. One month in is in no way enough to even scratch the surface. Maybe I'll extend my vacation for another six. Barry, don't even think of coming to join me. Wouldn't want to make all the cute girls cry, yeah? So you just leave the babes to me. Jill, if Claire tries to contact you, please let her know I'm okay. Chris Redfield. Okay. This does not sound like Chris. Some machine gun. Uh, yeah. So this gun has a full clip. No, it does not. Now it does. I just want to make sure. Okay, is there anything else in here? High grade gunpowder. Uh, all right. Nick is walking around. <coughs> He's above me, I think. <sighs> What's this? Dialogue. I don't have the thing for that. Stairs. The jack. I do have the tool for the jack in the library. Wait, I don't... Do don't I? Oh, I didn't grab it. Where was it? Oh, it's in the... Uh, it's in the heart room, I think. It's in the in the records room. So if I can get downstairs to the save area right here, then I can get to this terminal, which I can use to get to the rest of the stuff in here. Um, so I need to move through the showers, down the stairs, into the save area. I have a feeling this guy's... Oh shit. He's right here now.
Okay. Oh shit! Who's that, a ligger? No, that's somebody who was sent by Umbrella to kill me. Okay. Whew. put my shit down. I'm also going to save here. Okay, so we're going to put this gear in storage. We're going to put this in storage. Um, let's see. What else? What else? Uh, I'm going to put this pistol in storage. Uh, there's no point in keeping it. Trench coat guy, yeah. This... Grenade can go there, whatever. Blue herb, I'll put it in storage for now. And we'll leak, keep the keys. Um, I can even put this button in storage technically, but I'm not going to. We're going to take the grenade launcher out because I, I might have to confront this dude. And I don't know if this submachine gun's going to cut it. And I have a green red herb combo. That should do it. And let's save real quick. Because I'm doing okay. <sighs> okay, let's go, let's go. I may have to kill this asshole. Now I don't have to deal with him. Did you kill it? Hmm? Kill the, the guy? No, 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 no. <laughs> no, I killed this little liquor. He's not little. These liquors, they're like these mutant beast things. And that they make things a lot worse uh, when you're dealing with the big guy. So I'm like, I don't want to deal with the big guy. So I'm just going to... I don't want to deal with him and the big guy, because this lets me run around. The liquors, like, they react to sound, and they're a pain in the ass, so... Okay, so we're going to go into the operations room. Last time, Mr. Mister X was here, but I think this time it won't be a problem. He's probably going to, like, spawn down here, though, when I go in here. Let's see. 
because this is where I need to use this key. To get that. And this grenade. And let's do a quick look to make sure there's nothing else in this room. Oh, there is something. Yep, he's gonna spawn down here. What the fuck? Another one? God damn it. I'm gonna die. <laughs> Did I go the wrong way? I must have gone the wrong way. Good thing I saved just before before this. Keep it down. <sighs> Sorry for the sh for the shouting. I don't know how sensitive the microphone is. Most weapons are but pea shooters before the mighty tyrant. I don't know if that's the tyrant though. Okay, so we're gonna, we're gonna do this shit again. I think I, yeah. We're just gonna kill this liquor and then we're gonna proceed. Maybe I'll, hmm, maybe I'll go to the safety deposit room and the dark room now and then use the thing later if that's, if that's like a set event, like that guy, you know? Didn't want to deal with that. Click. Okay. So let's see. 103. Two oh three. That was the problem. There was a liquor that spawned in the room that I was going. It wasn't there before.
This guy's thorough. He's checking like everywhere. So he went off that way. Why are you playing as Whammon? Uh, because the demo lets you play as uh, Crit as uh, Leon, and I wanted to see Claire's run through two o three. So we're gonna open that two o three. And uh, one o three. Is there anything else? Got me another hit pouch. Starting to look like a Rob Liefeld character. Okay, this room is cleared out. Now I'm just gonna go to the save room and organize my shit and my thoughts. The hardest setting, yeah, sure. Making sure it's clear. This dude is close. Yep. Okay, so you can hide from him, duly noted. Seems to be the way to go. So he's in the operations room or over in that direction. get to the dark room. Okay. I made it. Whew. All right. Uh, let's see. I'm all out of grenades, so I'm going to store this. Is there a way to make grenades? Maybe there is, but... So we're, we're gonna keep... We're gonna keep the... Oh, we got a gunpowder here. That's good. Just you see, Brian, you think it's hard now, but wait until part two, they'll let you play as a housewife. What's the point in living? Um, we're gonna take that out. Uh, I think that's good. Let me save here. Oh, man.
man. Hey, Jojo, how you doing? Babe, how you doing? Okay. Cold? No. You're like wearing a t-shirt and shit. What the fuck? I don't have any film. It's a bit stressful having this guy walking around looking for you the whole time. You can hear his footsteps and shit. Alright, so when I leave here, I could go upstairs. I need to get to the records room. That's where the that's where the crank thing is at. Or the 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 jack. I need the jack handle. It's in the records room. Fairly certain that if I can get to the jack handle. Where's the library level? Yeah. Wait, if I can get to the jack handle, it'll it'll get me into this level of the main hall, which then I can use to get to the clock tower. That's when I'll probably need the gear. Blue herb, combat knife. What am I missing here? A safe, I don't have that yet. Electronic door panel, crank handle slot, I don't have a crank, typewriter, item box, dial lock, jack. Yeah, that's where the jack needs to go. I don't have the dial lock yet either. Are there other people leaving comments except Great Indoors and it's just not showing for some reason? I'm going to check. Give me a second here. Oh yeah, no, Frenchinator says why play as Wayman. Okay, so... I do have the diamond key. I could also head down there and see what's here. And there's another crank handle slot. Wait, can I go get the crank from the other places and use it in these other spots? I don't know where I left the crank though. Or have I not have I just not gotten the crank yet? I don't even remember. How about that? Green herb. You know, you can talk if you want to. High grade gunpowder. Mm. All right, well. So. I'm gonna leave the dark room Go into this area, get to the records room. That's what I gotta do. It's the only thing I can do. It's either that or I go upstairs and go around. How close is this to the original as far as locations? They change things up, so if you've like memorized Resident Evil 2, like if you're if you're a person who's been playing it, you're not gonna like um You're it's not the same. The layout is different. Oh shit. Yeah. But sp it's very it's reminiscent. So it doesn't feel like it's completely different. They've also tried to explain why, you know, um, you're in a police station, but it feels like you're in a Victorian castle with all the secret doors and gems and shit that you got to place 
to get around by by saying it's a it used to be a museum it's not really the great explanation but I'm waiting for Mr. X to like wander off. I don't know where he is though. I'm going to be doing a review later on on uh, Honey Badger um, live streams. Uh, with someone who's probably already gone through it with both <laughs> characters. I haven't had time, though, myself. <coughs> I think he's behind me now. So, I'm gonna go out, make a run for this room, and try to get into the records room. Now, when I go in there, dude is gonna spawn in there no matter what. So, I've already killed the liquor in this area um so i should be able to get out so let's see what happens did i save in this room already i'm gonna save again i don't remember <laughs> shoot him in the face it won't matter but it's really satisfying yeah just notice the title president evil yeah I'm honestly not sure where this asshole is at. It just he sound, it sounds like he's like right outside. Did you get a better weapon yet? Um, I have the grenade launcher, but no ammo. I have a submachine gun uh, and the handgun. I just got the submachine gun. That's basically the peak. And you know, it's not really... The, the grenade launcher seems to be the best thing for um, Mr. X. He's right over there. Which means he's right outside. They did a really good job with the sound. It really tells you where he's at. He stopped walking. I think he's going away. No, he's like right fucking there. All right, so let's see. Um, I'm going to have to go upstairs. So I'm going to go upstairs into the shower room, down the hall. I got to do this the long way. Get into the library. This is the save room, but I don't know if he can't come in here. If you beat it under four hours, I think you still get the minigun. Yeah, perhaps. I'm not going to beat it in under four hours, though. It's not going to happen. I don't know. I don't know. It's a really good remake, though. I mean, this is like what remasters and remakes should be. The only thing, okay.
he's gonna come in here. Maybe not. No, he is. The music is starting. So creepy. Uh huh? So creepy. But I, I think I'm gonna be okay this time because I've killed the liquors and shit, so... Um, I'm going to go into the operations room and just like, yeah, I'm going to run into the operations room. Bye, nigga. What, are you going to follow me over here? Okay, so now, uh, let's see, let's head into, he's going to come back down, he's got to walk back, so we're going to head south to the west office and try to get back into the main hall, that's what I'm going to do. Wait, that's not right. Now I gotta kill my friend who predictably was gonna turn to a zombie. Okay, so now I have the crank thing so I can head up to the library. Well, you said it when you were sorry, so. Yo, let's go up this the fucking ladder. climbing the ladder. Okay. I've avoided him. Uh, let's see. So we're going to head north and back into the operations room. I just got to I got to rope a dope him for a bit before I can get back in that library and move those bookshelves over. Cuz that's going to take a little bit of time and you can't do that with this nigga running around. No. Uh, chasing you. Uh, you can shake him off, I think. It seems like it, but I think there are fixed points where he will find you no matter what. Like, you hit a milestone and he'll just show up, so... So he's got a... Yeah. 
This is library. <laughs> All right. I think I lost him in a way. I mean, he certainly doesn't know where I am right now. But this. He's downstairs towards the front on the right side. So not that close to where I am. So this gives me time to do this. Unless one of these fucking zombies decides to wake up. stairs. Now there could be anything up here. Hopefully this dude doesn't show up up here, but he might. I hear zombies. There goes one. Um, looks like it's a dead end going that way. It's the door to the clock tower. That's a locked door, so I can't go there. Wait, wait, wait. No, wait. I can get to it from the outside. Oh, what's up, bro? I hear more zombies. I hear Mr. X walking around. Well, how is he on this side? I think when the music plays, it means he knows that you're there, but I'm not sure. I'm just gonna wait. Oh, the zombies are outside. That's what that sound is. I 
I gotta get to that door just to unlock it so that I can access this from the other side if I wanted to. the music playing. Oh, there's a green herb in the corner. Alright, let's head to the door. Let's just do it. So that's the storage room. I remember this room. And there's a knife in there. Blue herb here. Pretty sure the zombies in this room are dead, but... Mm. It's not worth it for a knife. I've got a combat knife. I can come back. <laughs> Fuck that. So he's teleporting around too, depending on like how much you've accomplished. So before I go into the clock tower, which I know is where they want me to go, um, I might need, maybe there'll be another save point up here, another storage box room, but um, I might need to go to the storage box room to get the gear because I'm fairly certain that I need it for the clock tower. It's a probably a puzzle. All right, well, let's just fucking let's just see. It's a note. Repair plan. Police station West Side Clock Tower. Due to the high cultural value of the bell, I'm going I'm calling a specialist in to make the repairs. We'll go over the details once they're on the scene, but in the meantime, I'll take steps to secure the bell since the yoke is threatening to break. And there's where the gear goes. So I'm not gonna likely find what's this? What is that? Well, I don't have that part either. And that's literally... Oh, there's a door here. Alright. Hmm. Zombies aren't likely to come in through this window, but... Because we're, like, really high up. But liquors might. Looks like it's just a dead end. That doesn't make any sense. There's an item. Large gunpowder. Okay. Yeah, we all know what green herb is. Okay. So now he's on this side, so maybe I can go on the other side, or will he just be over there suddenly? Where was that nigga at? Oh, there he is. I see him. He's walking around down there. He 
he may have seen me. I'm gonna go to this side. Okay. Get that blue herb. save. So there's a hardcore mode. I almost played it. Um, so like in the old Resident Evils, right? In this one, you basically, every time you see a typewriter, you can save. And um, I think it does some auto-saving as well. But in hardcore mode, you it, you have to it's basically like the original Resident Evil. You have to get ribbons, and you can only save you can only save at uh, typewriters, and you have to have the ribbon to save. It uses up a a, a a ribbon, and that's more like they call it hardcore mode because it's basically more like the original in that way. Shit, was that the the door I was just at? <laughs> okay, so I want to get the large gear so I can go up to the clock tower um but some things have to go back so we're gonna store this store this store this um move that over move mm, yeah move this over what else i think that's it oh hold on i don't need the heart key anymore so we'll store that too Oh, right. This is the elevator. This is probably a good move. I can go down and then um, the elevator, I think. Wait, what? So, yeah, this will go down to the basement. Elevator control room. Maybe I can get to this door. So, maybe I'll do that. I don't know if he'll follow me down to the basement, but he might. Let's try it. There's nothing in here.
pretty sure he's still above me. This place might be more fucked up, though. Yep. Try and walk slowly, because it could be... It's If anything, it's probably a liquor. There's a liquor right there. It's okay, though. I just need to go in this room. I don't need to fuck with him. really all there is? Oh no. More film. LS LS still says worst part of the game. What do you mean? Alright, let's see. So back out. Um what's this? Generator room? I was able to get in there. No, crank handle slot. I need the crank. I need the crank handle, but where the hell is it? Card reader. I don't have the card. Mm, another locked door. So I'm going to head back out. Yeah, no spoilers. I... I Leave you alone, buddy. I've already been in there. I've already been in the morgue. Everything in there is done. I do need the crank handle slot or the crank, but I'm not going to sweat it. Didn't you come across a crank last time? I had a jack handle, a gear, which I'm carrying. Um, yeah, if there was, I, it was on a desk. I mean, I see the slots. I'll check every floor, okay? So, because it, it normally marks those places of interest so that you don't forget, which is really nice of them because I don't think that they did that before, but. Wait, what? T bar handle slot. No, it's not saying anything about that. Oh, you're you're saying the part the part that I'm dealing with. Yeah. It's just one of the worst parts. Mr. X. They gave they did him justice though, I gotta tell you. Because like other Resident Evil games, they put a lot of focus on the tyrants. And I mean, you know, tyrants are I mean, they're 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 gross and strange, but they're not really scary. But Mr. X is pretty like stress-inducing. He's just like this big dude looking for you. It's pretty. He's way more interesting, in my opinion. Uh, dial lock, gunpowder, dongle. Already got that. Door panel, crank slot again. Red herb, green herb, safe. And I was just in the third floor, and there's nothing there. Gearbox. Gearbox. So I need two gears to get the 
thing working. I don't know. Um... Currently searching. Oh, maybe the the red areas are not fully searched yet. That doesn't make sense. I was in this room. There's nothing in here. No, that that doesn't really make sense. Like how she like covers herself from the rain, like oh, you know, despite everything that's going on, what I really, really don't want is to get wet. That's a decent looking alligator head, but I've seen bigger. Okay. Um. The door panel. Oh, I needed another part for that. Safe. I don't have the thing. Yeah, she's alright with crawling through blood, right? Uh, I'm at a loss here, so let me think. I got the gear. I guess the only thing I can do is put the gear in the clock. Maybe uh, I'll get another item. So I gotta go up here. It's the only thing there is. Oh shit. Yeah, I need another thing to open that. There's something in there. What is that? Oh, it's the ID card. I need that. So this is like the ultimate get. And there's nothing else here. All right, so the key card is in this room. I keep that in mind. Thank God. The key card. All right, so hmm. I think the red areas are basically saying that there's unfinished business in these in these areas. That's probably what it means. Like I need a key or there's something that's locked or something like that. So, so the armory I'm not finished in here, probably because the gunpowder is still in here. All right, let's uh save at the since I don't have to worry about ribbons. Let's save here. It's fucking cold. Hmm. We're gonna store some, some, some shit. We're gonna head out. Your phone just made a noise. Did it? It's not ringing though. <coughs> mm, 
I'm not seeing. Hmm. All right. So I'm going to head through there. Mm, I got to go up the stairs. The only thing I can do. Um, and then I'm going to, I guess I got to, I got to pass through the storage room. Go across the hall to the clock tower. Whew, all right, here we go. So what if I go downstairs? What will happen? If I go downstairs, uh, I don't have the clover room for that. Oh, yeah, there's a liquor in there. Um, yeah, there's a liquor in there. I have a grenade, I guess. I could kill him with that. But it wouldn't really matter, like, there's no place to go, because I don't have the clover key. Alright, let's see if... Let's see if I can cut through here, because it's the only... seems to be the only safe way. There is a door across the hall, but... Oh, yeah. Wait, that's the balcony. Mr. X on roller skates, stress inducing, yeah. Also really silly. Alright. Is that this? Yes. So we got a la we got stairs. I feel really unprepared for what's coming. small gear so I guess let's try putting that in So what did that do? Let me go back up.
Yeah, it is quiet. I wonder if this noise attracted monsters. You know what I'm anticipating? People who've played the original Resident Evil I can't get up there. There's gotta be a way to like move these boards. Uh, people who played the original Resident Evil 2 know that Mr. X, the first time, I believe the first time he shows up, or maybe it's a little later, but he bursts through the wall to get to you. And I'm waiting for him to do that. Like, I know that it's coming, right? Like, they, they're making him look like he's just wandering around, but he's supposed to be bursting through the wall at any moment. It, it could be any time. I don't know. I'm, I'm guessing that it'll be, like, right after I accomplish some milestone goal. Like, I thought it was going to be after I put the gear in. I thought it was going to be after I did the second gear. There's not a lot of room to avoid him here, though, so it doesn't really make s Shit. Is he this close? Oh, shit. Yeah, maybe. I don't know. It could be at any time. I gotta think what to do. Uh, they put the large gear there, like I could still grab it. What would it do? What would I do? Maybe I can put it... There we go. Well, that's not good. That works. Yeah, it also made a shit ton of noise. So I'm going to go get that 
I'm gonna go get that box, and the motherfucker is gonna be like John Cena. <laughs> Okay, let's uh, open this box. I know what this is. This is the um, the other part that I need to get into the room where the key is at. Okay. Yep. My work here is done. Alright, he's not out here. So, I got that. I gotta get to the office. So let's head this way. He's on that side. That's the wrong way. Shit. I'm gonna save again. Cause fuck all that. Is the gameplay the same no matter who you choose? No. Uh, Leon's gameplay is different and his um... I think I think that if I I don't remember for sure, but I think that the stuff that you depending on who you play as first changes the gameplay for the person you play as after. And so, like, what Claire's actions affect Leon's gameplay. Oh, um, oh shit, uh. oh, it's just like one of those fucking Peter Parker puzzles, I didn't even notice. Wait a minute. What am I supposed to do? Oh, okay, okay. I can rotate any of these pieces. Um... Yeah, I didn't even realize it was a puzzle. Maybe I'll... Hmm. Alright. So I gotta...
I don't even know what I'm doing. Like, <laughs> I have no idea. Okay, so I'm guessing red and blue have to become purple. So I need to... I mean, it doesn't look like... Oh, I see. I see. I see. There we go. Cinematic. Okay. Why she look like Jill? J Law, yeah. All all women in video games look like J Jennifer Lawrence now. Did you see Mary Jane in the Spider-Man game? She looks just like this woman. And like the chick from Assassin's Creed Odyssey, and the chick from Horizon Zero Dawn. I don't remember this character. I remember this little girl, though. Don't worry, Sharon. It'll be all over soon. There has to be a way Is it out. okay that the oven's still on? What? Is it okay that the oven's still on? Yeah. Oh, shit. I gotta play Claire now? Well, I know this is a stealth mission now. Okay. Can I run? All right. What the fuck is up with your toys? Yes, I'll, 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 yeah, I guess I'll take that. <laughs> what? All right. Ugh. I guess I'll leave. It's locked? Alright, let's check the... Let's check the Humpty Dumpty doll and see if there's anything about it. Uh-huh. game.
This two star thing is bullshit. Maybe I'll put this one on the end. Hmm. Annoying puzzle is annoying. All it is is just like, I guess I'll just keep doing this until something happens. I'm not going to memorize all the fucking block faces. All right, all right, all right. Let's see. So, which ones have a star on the on the right? All of them. All right, which ones have a circle on the left? No, that one doesn't, so that one's out. This one does. This one does as well. Okay, so that one's circle to square, circle to square. So, I'm going to go with not this one. And we'll mm, try to complete that. This one will end on star. Um, it's solving puzzle. What is this? Yeah, there we go. Right? Wait, it didn't work? Oh, do I have to match them on top instead? Oh, yeah, I do. I can't really see it. I think it's square and triangle. Oh, okay. All right, motherfuckers. So we need a... So that makes more sense. So we need a star and square. Um, star and a square on top. So let's narrow it down that way. Okay, let's see which ones have star on the right. Nope. It's got to be this one. Yep. Okay, and that looks good. So these are only going to work one way, right? I mean, one would think that one is good. So it's just this one now. Hmm. Yeah, I know, I heard you. That's a triangle, not a square. So what else is a uh, square and triangle, or circle and triangle, that can go on the right side? Not that one. Not this one. So it's so these two have to be right. What else has a triangle and star? Not that one. Not that one. Oh yeah, that one does. Maybe we'll try this one instead, and we'll. Uh, what else? Is that a square? I think that's a square. Holy so it's between these two. Holy what? Hell. Holy hell. Holy bird. You see your breath? Huh? Yeah, I can see my breath a little bit. Uh oh. I know. It's, below zero it's not right good. Ugh. Look for square top and bottom. Zen man. Zen man. It's not a. What was that? Never mind, you can't hear me. Oh my god. Alright, let me. I gotta get a little closer. I wanna make sure that the puzzle shapes. So on the 
Yeah. On the right, it's square and circle. On the left, it ends on triangle and star. So. <laughs> okay. Look for square, top, and bottom. Okay. Someone commented on one of your activities, Paul LeBlanc. Thank you, Paul LeBlanc. Boom. I got some scissors. Hopefully they're safe. Got me some scissors, scissors, boy. All right, now what? I'll go over here and use the scissors on this thing, right? Because I can, because I couldn't just tear the tape off. I had to go through this fucking ordeal. What is this? <laughs> it's a cleverly hidden secret room behind a piece of cardboard that was right next to your room. No one thinks to check there. There's nothing in here to interact with. OMG, so creepy. I thought somebody said that. Huh? Nothing. <laughs> Keep forgetting you can't hear me. This child imagery thing is kind of a it's kind of tropey though, isn't it? I don't really find it that scary. Besides, who the hell like this is actually a pretty good uh, and lenient parent to let you just like paint all over the walls and put your little hopscotch thing down. Sally's diary. Sally, Wednesdays are perfectly great days cuz we get snacks and ice cream. I hate the last place I was at. The teachers are all meanies. Nobody says meanie. It was just study, 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 and there wasn't wasn't no ice cream. That's a double negative, Sally. I love, love, love it here. January 10th. There was an important rule made today. Everyone must write a diary, get health checkups, and we ain't allowed outside by ourselves. It's good that we don't have to go to school. Nobody writes out have to like that I don't want to go and get picked on for my old clothes specifically not by the guy that used to wear them January 16th the orphanage director is coming today so I'm gonna wear my most favoritist checkered blue outfit this is like dialogue written <laughs> this is like this is uh, you know it's like shit that people write about you know like that when they're writing ch a children's dialogue but they themselves have never had children. So they're going by like this old timey, like, you know, this is the way kids spoke in the 80s, the 70s. Uh, the orphanage director is coming today. So I'm a gonna, I'm a gonna wear my most favorite is checkered blue outfit. The director is tall. The director has a mustache. The director is a policeman. <laughs> okay. <laughs> See the director run, run director, run. <laughs> okay, that's it. I guess that was a clue I was supposed to take away from that. Text writing. Yeah, it would have been like, OMG, director's so big. <laughs> Drawers are heavy. Rainbow. A house so 1979 yeah shit that never happened don't don't we know that like children these days only write woke woke takes <laughs> that's what kids write about is the bad blonde man gonna send my friends away why do people hate each other so much this kid I guess she's like this is a, this isn't her house. This is like some nursery or something. I want to look. I'm going to check this room. All right, there's nothing in here. There's another door here. It's probably locked, but 
Yeah. That's what I thought. Written better than most YouTube comments. Yeah. The director is Y. P. Po. I mean, I get that they're going to make it, they're trying to, like, create some creepy atmosphere, but the fact that I don't have the ability to defend myself at all lets me know that all I got to do is hide if anything happens. And there's going to be plenty of, there's going to be plenty of ample opportunities to do that. Yeah, I'm, I'm not going to be able to leave. But I'm going to look around first. Can I climb on shit? Nope, can't go that way for some reason. Oh man, I'd love to get back there, but this damn chair is in the way. Well, guess I can't go that way. Some of these obstacles, you know. Mm, that's not really a good hiding place. Darn it! I need the key! Yeah. Little girls can't do shit anyways, that's right. Worse than the tyrant. Worse than Mr. X. It's a straight white male. Policeman. <laughs> I mean, what do we want? Dead cops. When do we want them? There's no... Where am I supposed to go? Let me just check. Director's room. There's a typewriter. I'll go save. Is he trying to make a wife? Diary. Blank's diary. If you're reading this, go call Colise. Boogeyman's here, eating everybody. Many dark boogeyman's here. Helk, they're coming. Helk me, mommy. Oh, OMG, scary, creepy little girl writing stuff. <laughs> it's so scary. Look how she uses the words. They're wrong because she's panicking. Alright, so I've saved. I still need the key, though. I may have to check this body for it, because, you know...
You're locked in here with me. It's all over now. Doors locked. Where are you? Show yourself. I know you're in here. The longer it takes me to find you, the worse it's gonna be. I think I need to get the key from him. What, what is he gonna do? Oh, he puts me back in my room. You are trapped. <laughs> oh no, you got put on, you're grounded. Game over. No, I don't wanna, damn it. I guess I just gotta wait until something happens and I'll get the key. Okay, okay. Uh. All right, I know what to do. I think. This is kind of a... You have to do this shit in Spider-Man. This is my least favorite bits. Because these are kind of scripted, right? Like, I think, you know... You have to hide a certain... It's not like you have... Where are you? Show yeah, yourself. I was thinking the same. He's gonna move over. And so when he does, I'll just go that way, straight ahead, after he moves that cradle out of the way. Your last 
last fucking chance. Show yourself. Now! If he looks under here, I'm fucked. Oh, it burns. Ah, oh, shit. I hate these. <laughs> They're really annoying. I think I want more coffee. Do you want more coffee? Mm, sure. Mm, sure. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. <laughs> Wait, what's going on now? Oh, I just got the key. <laughs> Why did you just turn the light on last time, nigga? I think I'm just gonna f ignore the front door and just go straight for the other one. But I might have to check the door because I'm a scripted, I'm a scripted shit. Oh, look at him, he's booking now. Got an axe? What the fuck? Get over it, bitch. You are what the fuck? Dead. That's bullshit. Wait, he did he suddenly had an axe and then he didn't? What the fuck is that? Okay, whatever. Alright, so I'm just gonna run for the door and fuck the front door and <laughs> He like runs faster than you too. It's like, well, well, I don't know. It's annoying. Mm, let's go. Uh. Fuck is my key. Uh. Yeah, I'm not gonna fucking waste time. Of course, he's gonna be right there. We gotta barely make it. What the fuck?
<laughs> door the fuck front the fuck the and it didn't even matter anyway so because divine intervention Do I have to play her again? Oh, 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 shit, am I... We've got unfinished business. Derp, derp, derp. What are you talking about? Don't waste my fucking time! Bring me the pendant, or Sherry dies. Pendant? What do you need it for? Do you want the girl to die? Fine. Where are you? The orphanage. The orphanage? Where is that? In the neighborhood. You'll find it. Sherry, all right? For now. I swear, you bastard, you hurt her. Well, that's what's boring about those. Uh, Zero's hobby says, I hate Damn it when it. the game has to save me from the game. That's, that's the problem with, um, I got my parking permit. <laughs> Resident Evil 2, the quest for the parking permit. Um, when the, uh, um, when you're doing those missions where you don't have any anything but stealth, which is like the Mary Jane ones from Spider-Man and the Miles Morales ones, the problem is is that those can only end with either you slipping away or you basically just live long enough for something else to come along and save you. And I just don't get the say I don't get the satisfaction. You know, I don't get any satisfaction out of that anyway. Got me a parking permit. Just you wait, asshole. I got my parking permit and. <laughs> okay, so now we're back on this tyrant, our Mr. X shit. So I'm gonna go save real quick. I hope they didn't, because they, they said they were lowering the difficulty during the Sherry bit. I don't want them to do that for this part. I just. It'd be really lame because you get killed by some bullshit on there, anyways. So, let me save. Or not killed, but grounded, sent to your room. I don't know. Oh, yeah, one more thing. The locket. Oh, I can't examine it? Oh, that's bullshit. So, it's clearly important because there's something in it, but I can't actually look at it. All right. I'm going to go make myself a pot of coffee, so if you guys don't mind uh, waiting, I'm going to pause. I'll be right back. Um, let me see. If there's a, is there a mute button on here? I'm going to try this.
All right, can you guys hear me now? I can go for about another hour and then I gotta quit. Um, someone made a comment that I wanna ask about. Drew Oliver said, did you get the Lightning Hawk? I don't know what that is, so I'm gonna say no. Okay. So I have the key. So now I can go downstairs. Tyrants, I mean, uh, Mr. X is still wandering around. Um, there's lots of unfinished business, but I can only assume that I can't do anything with it just yet. So the only thing I can do is head downstairs. I could go over here and get these this green and red herb, though. So maybe I'll do that. No, I can't. I can't go that way. I got to go upstairs. I think. Let's head this way. X for murder. This nigga's gonna show up downstairs, anyways. He's just going to be where he needs to be. So I'll have to deal with him at some point. Um, okay. So what I need to do is... Come over here. See? I knew it! <laughs> he just needed to be where- he's just where he needed to be. Okay, where do I go? That's where I came out. Oh, I gotta head to the orphanage. Hmm. Hearing weird noises in the kitchen. What? Hearing weird noises in the kitchen. Um, what kind of noises? I don't know. Whapping. Oh, shit, that's not good. One thing that's good about Mr. X is he does a lot of the work for me when it comes to zombies. Like the if they get in his way, he like pimp slaps them, but... Is he not chasing me? Nigga's gonna spawn up ahead. What is it? Umbrella. See if Umbrella is right for you. Ask your doctor. Look at that sister's badonka donk. What the hell is up with you? This 
stop it. I will cut you, bitch. Try my bitch. Oh shit, the fucking dogs. Fucking zombie dogs. Zombie Dobermans. I didn't want to do that, man, but zombie doggos are best doggos. I have to kill this one, too. I'll try and do it from here. I hear more of them. I don't think I have enough ammo to deal with these. Dog peepo. Such undead. Much scare. Here they come. Oh yeah, I <laughs> need that. Hmm. That's a way of them telling you you're about to fight a bunch of dogs. What the, hell? What the fuck, nigga? <laughs> what are you doing, man? You see him climb the fence? Leslie used to do that. Are they going to make a Resident Evil Nemesis remake? I think that Capcom is probably going to see how well this one does. And maybe they will based on that. You know what I you know what the Resident Evil game that I think is really underrated? I can't remember the name of it. Um just making sure. Wait. Yeah, they have those too, like like from the old Resident Evil Five, uh, Re Resident Evil Five and Six. There's a dog out there, but I don't really want to deal with him. Where you have to like shoot the medallions, but they've made them raccoons. Anyway, like I was saying, there was this one Resident Evil. Uh, That's gotta be the orphanage. There was this one. Resident Evil co-op online game. It was the first one they ever made. And I think it was like up to four players. And they played these regular citizens. So they weren't like cops or anything like that. And each one had different skills. And you had to like use all of their skills to get through the levels. I liked that one. That was, that was a good game. I can't remember what it was called though. I think it was... Maybe it was called Outbreak? I think it was called Outbreak. 
Oh, we get it. We get it. You're... Yeah, yeah, we get it. You're strong and independent. It was on PS2. Uh, it may have been on other things, too. There's a tyrant in there! But you don't know! Hopefully the Mr. X bit is over, but I somehow doubt it. Wait, I thought this shit was locked up. Alright. I guess we'll, let's look around first. Let me go upstairs and see if she's in the room. Sherry? Sherry, are you here? I don't want them to do a Resident Evil 4 remake. They'd redo the voiceovers and the original uh, campiness would be lost. Yeah, no. Outbreak. It was Outbreak. That's right. Yeah, Resident Evil 4 is fine. It doesn't need a remake. Oh, that's the first aid spray. Something that he should probably have used on himself. Oh, what's this? Group showers. In a nursery? It's creepy as shit. An orphanage? Letter from the director. Regarding the incident in question, I'm glad to report that it has all been taken care of. On February 19th, test subject 628 escaped from the lab and broke into our facility. 628 was originally from this facility's candidate pool and apparently returned in the hope of seeking help. 628 was quickly detained by our staff. As 628 was undergoing one of the lab's clinical trials, there was the distinct possibility that he had brought the virus with him, so we disposed of all of our test subject candidates as a precaution. Their speedy disposal was conducted by the security team, to whom I'd like to extend my thanks. As for our neighbors, we told them that due to the building's dilapidated state, we have temporarily moved all of the children to a different orphanage for their safety. As to the future of this facility, once it has been fully deemed contaminated, I plan to resume securing more test candidates. Hmm. <laughs> You found some bullets inside the laundry. I will take them. Alright, let's go downstairs. I'm hoping for a Tyrant versus Mr. X showdown. Like Godzilla meets the Frankenstein's monster or something. That doesn't really make a lot of sense. But you know what I mean. Godzilla versus King Kong or... Is that Two-Face? Oh, brother. Jesus Christ. Where'd that little thing go? Or don't you care about that? <laughs> Where did it go? I'm gonna go back and find it. Did it leave? No. That's not gonna come back and bite me in the ass later. <laughs> Male disposability. He's a white male, it's okay. Your fault. <laughs> oh no. She was so beautiful. Hey, can I save at the typewriter? I can. Wolfman versus Frankenstein, yeah. No, Wolfman versus King Kong. Oh, it's a ladder. What? Okay.
whatever you say. Okay, I'm going to stop here and get myself a cup of coffee. I'll be right back. Okay, I'm back. Got my coffee. I'm ready. Mm. Thanks for coming and hanging on the stream. So I'm going to be doing a review with... I'm not going to finish the game, but the guy I'm going to be talking to, he's finished it. I'm just going to try and make some progress. I can only go for about another half hour or something. Oh, this looks like... What, what's going on here? Hmm. Oh, this, what, this? Ah, oh, boy. Shoot him in the face. Oh, what? Just like I thought. Oh, Nemesis? Was that the Nemesis? I, I do hope they do Resident Evil 3 Nemesis in um, a remake. That'd be good, too. Yeah, yeah, she called him daddy, of course. Toxic fatherhood. She also looks like Lara Croft, the way she looks now. They all look the same! Where's Sherry? These, like, brown-haired, female, Sherry's like, fine. you know, attractive but not sexy protagonists that they're doing now. I remember that one streak of time in gaming where all the male, all the protagonists were, like, these, like, white dudes with shaved heads. And I was getting tired of that, too. But these, like, 
Mary Jane, Laura Watson, Claire Redfield, fucking brown haired chicks with ponytails that look kind of plain. Tell me, what happened to William? I don't know. Where are you going? Look, mm. I don't have time to play 20 questions. Everything's under control. I need to find Sherry. My daughter is not your concern. She's got a lazy eye. Sherry's her daughter? Oh, come on. Acting surprised. All right, where the fuck am I? I hope that wasn't wrong. I probably should have looked around up there first. Sherry, can you hear me? Yeah, the Mass Effect Andromeda effect. Mm, sewers. And me without a blue herb. Claire got jokes, people. She got jokes. Oh, yeah. Mm. Hmm. There were a few of those, and I didn't find it. Hopefully, I'm going to be able to go back. What is that? That's not a rock. This is high grade gunpowder. Somebody flushed down the toilet. Still grinding on Bloodborne? Well, that's disgusting. I love Bloodborne. I haven't I haven't played it in a while. I finished it and then I started a second playthrough. Hmm. That pipe's not there for no reason. The thing that pisses me off the most about that game is that there are no good waifus. The Asari is hideous, the Biotic Woman is masculine. Are you talking about uh, Mass Effect Andromeda? Why'd you buy it? Did you buy it? It's just not a good game. Is that Jank? with you, brother. Read this note. Copy of emails to Umbrella Headquarters. Director Owens, there are alarms going off all over Nest. I don't know what's going on, but I can hear gunfire and I can't reach my section chief. We're trapped. Please send help ASAP. Dear Owens, Director Owens, the situation here is dire. Nest has been contaminated with the virus. It's unbelievable. The fail-safe system didn't activate at all. Is this the work of outsiders? I can't imagine who else it could be. But why? Mayor and Kim are dead. I can't stop coughing. Why won't you answer me? Itchy, tasty. Director Owens, you. It was you all, uh... <gasps> what does he say next? <laughs> I don't know what it could be. I can't possibly put that together. Okay. I need 
need my box. Where is the box? Oh, some fucking one shot. Okay, could go that way. I don't see any zombies in there. Doesn't mean they're not in there, though. Stuck the landing, considering she's not a trained cop or anything. The voice actor for Sherry sounds like she's like 30. I'm just telling you now. Sounds like a 30 year old Sherry. woman trying to do a little Sherry, girl and it just, it just, <laughs> it just doesn't sound good. I'll be right there. OMG, she's in danger. Oh, hey, hey, that's what I'm talking about. Mm, do I have any? Nope. I might need that. Oh, uh, what else? Uh, yeah. Uh, yeah. Store that. Oh man, I'm like low on bullets. Can I combine a a large gunpowder and a regular gunpowder? Let's find out. I can. It's so dumb. But okay. I'm I guess you're supposed to. But like, it doesn't make sense because wouldn't you, if it takes two regular gunpowders to make some bullets, and you could combine a large gunpowder with this regular gunpowder to make more bullets, couldn't you just use a, a large gunpowder to make bullets? Like, is that the quantity of perhaps two of the regular gunpowder? It, it doesn't make any sense. Oh yeah, the roll of film, I didn't develop it. I hope I get a chance to go back to um, to the police station, because there's a lot of unfinished business here. All right, what's what's over here? Um, stuff I need. Yeah, what's this? Um, oh, I got the the horse part, the horse fuse. Pretty sure the rook and knight are all on the same wall, and the bishop and queen aren't next to each other. The queen and rook were opposite each other too. Okay. I lost the thing that tells you how to unlock the door to the U area during that last mad dash of a transfer. I know you have to stick one plug into each terminal, but if anyone remembers which plug goes where, please be a pal and share by posting the info on this board. Find the plugs. It's a bishop, also known as a penis. And a pawn. Mmm... The same wall and the bishop and queen are not next to each other. The queen and the rook were opposite each other, too. Ugh. Okay, so I gotta look around and find the rest. Is this a way I can go? No. So where can I go? There's a door there. Alright, so I'm gonna store 
all the parts in here. Oh, what's this? That's a VCR player. Okay. Sewers company pamphlet. Greetings from the CEO. Thank you for your interest in Knight's Construction Company. Over the past 20 years, we've had the honor to work on the sewer systems of some of our country's greatest cities while never losing sight of our two core principles of playfulness and superior industrial design. At KCC, we believe that just because our work is subterranean doesn't mean our designs have to be subpar. More refined than a queen, more polished than a knight, and as pleasant as a pawn. Are pawns pleasant? Our work is <laughs> sure to bring great victory to everyone involved. May we all meet on the field someday. Knights Construction C CEO, World Chess Alliance Honorary Member, Raccoon Chess Club Honorary Advisor, blah, blah, blah. R.B. Fisher, okay. So they're just saying, this is why the parts look so stupid. <laughs> Please don't judge us for this. You don't have to cover your ass. Alright, so I'm going to put away all these parts. Because I don't want them taking up space. Okay, I have three, and I need three more. And what time is it? It's 1.42, so I'm going to play for 20 more minutes, and then i got to stop. i got to stop, i got to set up the show for later. Uh, we're going to be talking about this game, and I just want to have as much of an experience with it as possible. I, I, if I had another week, I could probably finish it, but yeah, I'm, I just got to... Um, we got to do a show, so I can't uh, waste too much time. Hmm. I see you. I see you. He seems dead. You know one thing they don't do anymore? So on the old Resident Evil, they used to uh, let you know that a zombie was dead when the pool of blood would appear underneath them after you did enough damage. They don't seem to do that anymore. Uh, it's the music that stops, but even then, you're not really sure, you know? All right. So let's, I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna test test this dude. That's how I do it. I give him a quick cut with a knife. Blue herb. Another blue herb. I have a feeling we're going to be fighting some shit that poisons you soon. Another safe. I don't have the combination. Uh, this guy's not carrying anything. Dragon, Qu Dragon Age Inquisition is just as bad. The only good woman is unbelievable and the only other options are a retarded ugly elf and an abrasi oh one of those big women those ma those masculine looking manly looking figures i don't even like those guys is, is it is it those i don't remember got me a red herb got that red herb though um i'm gonna go put that red herb in the thing because i need to, i need to like manage my space so we're gonna put these put both of these I think I'll take one blue herb with me in case there's a poison effect that happens. Oh shit, is that bleach? Because I could just end this right now. Bullets! It's a good thing I contemplated suicide. I wouldn't have found that. Alright, I'm going to put this red herb away. And I'll hold on to the blue one. Wait, 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 what? Oh, I got a map. Man, I didn't even see. Okay. Now. Wait, what? Video player. Yeah. Plug socket. Okay. 
Is there one I forgot? It only shows one. No, they're all empty. Wait, they're marked, aren't they? Oh yeah, they are. Not all of them. So the knight goes there. So I can, yeah, I'll come back to it. A water cleaning facility? Yeah, it's some, something like that. It's the next area. What is it? Underground facility. Sewers. I think there's, this is the uh, where the alligator boss used to be, wasn't it? Hold on a second. Hmm. Wasn't there a, um, a place? Yeah, it was this T bar handle slot. I need to get to that. Okay, it'll it should come around. I'm just gonna hold on to it. I don't have to worry about Mr. X anymore, but unless they bring him back. <clears throat> Delivery receipt. The item below has been delivered to the location specified in your order. Heat resistant safe times one. The combination is written on the side of the safe in chalk. Please remember to erase it before you use the safe. I think that's where you that that should take us to the lab level, which is usually the last level um, of Resident Evil. I think it's in the sewers somewhere. Yeah, that that's uh, there's a little bit of lag between when you comment and when I respond. How about this door? Have I, I haven't been this way yet? There's a zombie down there. Okay. Oh, I think this is where I... No, I'm not sure. But I'm going to go over here and check out... There's a safe over here, I think. I think. Okay, where's the safe? Or was it not in here? Oh, yeah, I knew it was, it's not in here, but it was, I do remember seeing it. A lot of, lots happened in the last half hour. All right, we got to go down this way then. Got to double back. This is way better than, uh, you know, the evil within. I was playing that one, did not care for it. How'd I miss? 
All right. Getting a little low on... There's another one there. Before I go pulling any switches. That's where I came down. It's another path. This guy, is this guy alive? Yeah, he is. It's worth it. One more bullet. Okay, so... So I could pull the lever. Or I could head down the stairs. I'm gonna pull the lever. Okay, so that will get me back over here, and I have the T thing, so that's probably the move. Oh shit. Okay, so we're gonna go this way. I'm gonna go. We're gonna go this way. I'm just gonna check. We're gonna check this shit out. Let's let's put that there. Yeah, that was all all of my nope. Oh, I got the I got the T bar still. So that's the thing I got to use for all of those. All of those areas. Okay, switching the submachine gun. Okay. No, that's not good. It's not what sewers are supposed to look like. I got a key. A sewer's key. Mm-hmm. I forget to, you know, like in the old days, you used to like... I used to examine everything, just like look at the look at the polygons. So pretty. I'll take it for granted now. How do we know what super sewers are supposed to look like? I just don't think that there's like pulsating fucking I don't no no nope. Nope. So much nope. Not now, anyways. He used to be a ninja turtle. Yeah. That one's broken. Does that mean I can't go this way? Nope, I can't go this way. So what's the point of this room?
Yeah, that doesn't make any sense. Oh, I think, meh. It, it probably means something later. You wouldn't put something here for no reason. All right. So let me check the time here. So it's 156. So I'm going to go down into this sewer. So it's the only place I can go, it looks like. Try to get to the next save point, and I'm going to quit. But I am pleased. This is a this is well well made. Those look like the Lost Plagos parasites. I don't I don't have the shotgun. No. my knife back. Well, I just used my last grenade. That's where I need to get. Yeah, it's their...
Uh, do I still have my knife? I do. I put a grenade in his mouth. <laughs> that was fucking creepy as shit. Well done, Capcom. And they've actually managed to, like, tie everything together, so... They're basically, like... Um, connecting Resident Evil 2 to Nemesis, pretty certain, and to Resident Evil 4. Well done, you fucking madmen. Okay, let's combine this with this. Move this bitch up here. Where is a typewriter? There should have been one floating in the sewers. Oh, man. What's that? I need the king plug. Alright, well, I don't have it, so... What about this? It's locked. Okay, what's that? Uh... Oh. Oh, ah. Okay. What is this? Is that the queen or the king? Queen plug, yeah. It even says it right there. Oh, Queen Plug goes here too. Alright, let's use it. Problem is, if I do, then I can't get it back. Well, I mean, if I go, if I, I can't get it back, like, I can't take it out and then keep going this way. So I have to leave it there. The King Plug? Yeah. What? That's the king. I'll just examine it so that I know what it's called. Because that's what you gotta do, apparently. And then I'll... I hear something moving around up there. Again, why would you design this this way? I'm just gonna check. Um, Alright. Let me grab this. I have to go back in here? Oh, this is fucked up. Mm. These 
motherfuckers making me do this. Okay. I guess I gotta get make, go go back across. There's only two of these. Pretty sure it was two. Can I shoot that nigga from here? I think if I draw him over here. Should I do that? The problem is if I run, hmm. If I run, I might lose my knife. All right, let me see. Where am I? Where am I going? I got to get to the ladder. That's what I got to do. I got to cross all this shit. Literally, and get to the ladder. Spark plug, spark shot, spark shot. I missed that. Hold up. I can't get in there. I see. It's a gun. Okay. Uh, plug socket, plug socket, plug socket, plug socket, plug socket. All right. Um, is there another way to get in there? Well, there's a door over there. Maybe, maybe I need to do this puzzle. Hold up. to see how to get in there. Looks like there's a door there that'll open. So I need the ah uh, yeah 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 okay. Yeah, this might this might help a lot. So let's go get that king plug. Oh, wait a minute. If I do that, I'm not going to be able to get in over here. I got to go get the queen plug. And put it here first. And now I'll go get the king plug. queen plug over here. See, you can only accomplish anything if Kangs and Quains work together. This is how you get things done. Oh, what's that? The spark shot. Uh, this gun fires wired metal prongs into your target, allowing you to fry it with electricity for as long as you have the weapon raised or uh, holding R L2 and continue to stay focused on your target. However, if you let the gun send too much power, the wires will snap after one final surge. 
Okay, so you have to manage it. That's worth it. So, now, I guess I'll grab... Oh, wait, 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 hold up, hold up, hold up. Unlock this. Okay. So, I should be able to get this easy now. Let's go through here. Well, doors are locked, but... So, let me grab this. Oh, fuck! Hmm... Okay. I don't have space. Damn gun takes up space. Alright. Um, I'm gonna have to use some of these herbs. Because I need room. And I don't want to throw any of this other shit away. So I'll use one blue herb. Or discard it. And I'll discard this green one. Makes me sad, but I don't know what else to do. Hold up. Ayo. So you be saying that. Okay, here we go. What's this? Another herb. Well, that could stay there. Hmm? Such a pain. annoying and I still haven't gotten to a goddamn save point okay it's time to go and face the music no I, f I feel I feel a little bit more strapped I might be able to handle these guys Let's see this this has shots though it does have limited ammo so Oh shit. I had to jump down to the water there. So I gotta go the other way. I went the wrong way. That thing's alive? Oh no, it's not. Okay. 
Okay, six shots left. I think there's just one more. What the fuck? Give me that a wide berth if you don't mind. Okay. Almost out of here. Ladder, bitch. Okay. Uh, all right, that ladder. That's those stairs will take me. This is the waterway. Oh, there was one of those in there, right? I wanted to use that. That's a, to the um, T-bar handle slot. If I go up the stairs, it'll take me into. What is this? A safe. Mm, I think I want the safe because I have the, uh, the thing for it, right? So let's get armed, though. Oh, wait, what? Oh, shit, that's not right. So I guess that that settles that shit. I go this way. Or wait a minute. Up the stairs goes nowhere, yeah. So I have to go back the other way. All right. Okay. So now I either go up the stairs and then to the safe. So that's this way. And the safe is over here. Oh, yeah. Uh, counter walk two. Left 2, right 12, left 8. Reinforce frame SLS 60. Oh. Damn it. Okay, I gotta leave it there. However, I'm pretty. I think I can go back to the 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 boxes over here, if I remember correctly. So we're gonna make some space. Mm, definitely gonna keep this electro gun. Let's store this and this. And we'll move that there. Move this there. Move this here. Now I'm gonna go get that frame. Oh, and uh, get my pistol too. So I think it's for this gun. Yeah. I wonder if I can upgrade that little bitch gun to like the the magnum. I wonder if that's what it's for. I have this.
What's some of your favorite cheesy dialogue from Resident Evil games? Is it, wow, what a mansion? Is it, uh, that guy's a maniac, why did he bite me? Sorry about that, babe. <laughs> That's a line, <laughs> I swear to God. Okay, I'm gonna save and quit here. Uh, so first, yeah, I'm gonna quit. Uh, let's combine this with this. The SLS 60, new and improved. So is it better than this though? Let's examine it. Um, five shot capacity handgun, easy to handle. Has um, oh can ha can fire fi high powered rounds. Where did everyone go? Bingo. <laughs> uh, it looks all right. I still I still prefer this one. I think. I mean, I like revolvers, as far as real guns go, but... This stream... was, uh, supported by Walther. Made possible by... JMB. What the hell does that mean? Alright, so... And this gun only holds five bullets, which doesn't make sense. I thought revolvers held six. Like, why? Anywho. I'm going to put this one back now that I've upgraded it. I still don't have a videotape. I'm going to hit up the typewriter here. I'm going to save and I'm going to quit and I'm going to set up the show for later. It's going to be at 5 o'clock Central Time. We'll talk about Resident Evil 2 and uh, I'll find something to talk about in the after show. I know that lots of dramatic shit's been going on with like Ubisoft and companies that I don't support anymore. So let's save here. Hope you guys enjoyed the stream. I think Resident Evil 2 is quite good. It's quite good. So, you shoot? Uh, no. I mean, I have. And I have nothing against guns. But I haven't in a while. <laughs> Neela, you're here just in time for me to quit. Um, so, I'm just going to see what I got to do next. So, I have... One, two, three... Four, five. I need one more part. The rook. And then I can do this and go into the next area. Okay. Alright, so anyway. With that said, I'm going to go ahead and get out of here. Thanks for coming on and hanging out. Um, yeah, and I'll talk to you guys, uh, well, in a little, a couple hours. I'll see you on the, the uh, Honey Badger Nerdcast. Alright? Talk to you later.